I've recently started to use OBS and I'm just discovering the subtle differences between duplicating and copying and pasting. And I thought I would share my findings with other new OBS users. First of all, let's have a look at duplicating scenes. Suppose we have a very simple scene which only has a text source, which is a caption that says scene one. If I duplicate this scene and change the text to scene two and rename it scene two, I now have a second scene with the correct caption. If I now switch back to scene one, you will see that the caption says scene two and the text source is called scene two. So when I edited the caption in scene two, this also changed the caption in scene one. Duplication has not therefore created two independent copies of the caption. It has created a single copy of the caption that is used in both scenes. If instead of duplicate, I now use copy and paste, the first thing to note is that scenes support duplication, but not copy and paste, while sources support copy and paste, but not duplication. If we now try to paste the source into a new scene, scene three, you will note that there are two options, paste reference, which is the default if you use control V. The other option is paste duplicate. If we first use paste reference and then edit the caption to scene three and rename it to scene three, if we now click between scenes one, two and three, we see that the caption in all scenes says scene three. So paste reference pasted the same instance of the caption into scene three. So we now have the same instance of the caption in all three scenes. This may be beneficial if you want to change the caption in multiple scenes with a single edit. But what if you actually want to have a caption specific to a scene? In scene four, I've used the paste duplicate option. I've edited the caption to scene four and renamed it to caption scene four. If you now click between scenes one, two, three and four, you will see that scene four is the only scene that has a caption that says scene four. So when I paste a duplicate, I pasted a completely new instance of the caption, which can be edited without affecting the other instance of the caption, which is in scenes one, two and three. So to summarize this, duplicating scenes uses the same instance of the source, but pasting duplicate creates new instances of the source. If you want to paste the same instance of the source, you have to use paste reference. I investigated this further with other sources and discovered that pasting duplicate is not always offered as an option. This table shows that all sources allow you to paste reference so that you paste the same instance of a source into another scene. However, a lot of sources do not allow you to paste duplicate and create a new instance of a source in another scene. This clip demonstrates this with an audio input capture device, which does not allow you to paste duplicate since this option is greyed out in the right click menu. However, for almost all the sources where OBS does not allow you to paste duplicate to create a new instance of a source, it is possible to add a new instance of the source. So you can have two instances of an audio input device with, for example, different audio levels for a mic. The downside is that you will need to enter any filters again for the new instance of the mic. The table highlights in yellow the only source, a video capture device, which does not allow you to add a new instance of a video capture device. To be honest, this is not strictly accurate because OBS does allow you to add a new instance of the video capture device in another scene. Unfortunately, 
it will not work. No video will be captured. The video feed is black. No input. Video drivers will normally only allow a single application to access the video feed at a time. The video driver will see the first scene as the owner of the video feed and will not allow another scene with a second instance of the video capture device to access the video feed. The only option that will work is to paste reference and have the same instance of the video capture device in another scene. In my setup, I have a camcorder providing video and audio feed to a Hopog Colossus 2 card down an HDMI cable. If I copy this source and try and paste it into scene 2, the only paste option that is available is paste reference, i.e. paste the same instance of the video capture source. From my perspective, the use of the same instance is not a problem from a video perspective, because in the second scene I can change the size of the video and move it around the screen. The problem that it does give me is that I cannot use the audio mixer to mute the audio from the camcorder in some scenes and have the audio unmuted in other scenes. The audio mixer settings are set for each instance of the video capture device. And because there is only one instance of the video capture device, it will be muted or unmuted in all scenes. I have read that OBS does plan to develop audio mixer settings that can be set independently in each scene, but that it is complex to implement, so I guess it's going to take some time. In the meantime, I think that the only solution is to use the audio output from a camcorder to connect to a mic input on your computer. Unfortunately, my camcorder does not have an audio output. I therefore use an external road mic connected to a mic input on my computer. The benefit to this is that the quality of the audio is much better than a camcorder's internal microphone. The downside is that I need to play with sync offset in advanced audio properties to get lip sync.